Once you have your solenoid removed, uh, you need to look at it and make sure you know what kind you have. This is considered a four post. One, two, three, four. So it's a four po post solenoid that also grounds to the body of the tractor by these back here. So we're going to show you now how to test your solenoid to see if it's the problem. All right, we are going to show you how to test the solenoid. This is my new one, so we're gonna show you it first. Uh, we have a wire going to the negative battery terminal on our mower battery that we're gonna connect to one of these posts at the bottom. It doesn't matter which one you connect it to. I just have some alligator clips that make it a lot uh, safer when doing this. Um, ideally, you would have cords with alligator clips on both ends. Uh, so you don't have to the risk of getting shocked. I'm going to take the two ends of my tester. I'm turned to continuity with the alarm. So if I touch them together, you hear the alarm. And I'm going to touch them to each of these posts. Again, it doesn't matter. And I'm going to touch the tip of these alligator clips. And you'll hear a click. And you see I get continuity. So this sends a, when you touch this to here, sends a 12 volt charge through the alternator, making the connection between these two poles. And if you get continuity at that point, you'll hear a click and then you'll get the continuity. Then you know the alter, that the solenoid is good. So I'll repeat the process with the solenoid that was in my lawn tractor. Again, connect the negative to one of the poles, hook up your leads, and then connect your alligator clip to the other one and you'll see I get no continuity. So there's no power getting from here to the center which has a magnet in it that makes the connection between these two posts. So this solenoid is bad. If you found this video helpful subscribe and give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos you can click the picture in the top left to see how to test the kill switches on a mower or you can click the picture in the top right to see a video showing how to level the deck on your mower. Use the comment section below if you have any questions.